Mastering modal verbs, unleashing their power in reported speech. Hello language lovers, and welcome to another exciting episode where we delve into the fascinating world of English grammar. Today, we're going to explore a very crucial aspect, modal verbs. Specifically, we'll be focusing on how these unique verbs are used in reported speech. So sit tight, grab a notebook, and let's dive in. Let's begin with understanding what modal verbs really are. Modal verbs are a type of auxiliary or helping verb that express various states of mood, such as possibility, necessity, ability, or permission. They are an integral part of English grammar and can significantly change the meaning of a sentence. Examples of modal verbs include can, could, may, might, shall, should, will, would, must, and ought to. They are powerful tools in your English language arsenal that can help you express complex ideas and emotions. Remember, modal verbs are special. They never change their form, and they don't need an S for the third person singular. Now that we understand what modal verbs are, let's see how they work in reported speech. In reported speech, we typically convey the meaning of someone's words in a different context and often at a later time. Therefore, when we report modal verbs, we might need to shift them depending on the context and the passage of time. For example, will often changes to would and can to could in reported speech. Let's consider this direct speech. I will pass the exam. John said. In reported speech, we would say, John said he would pass the exam. However, it's essential to remember that not all modal verbs change in reported speech. Could, would, should, might, and ought to usually stay the same. While the theory is important, Practicing with real sentences is the key to mastering modal verbs in reported speech. It can initially feel challenging, but with regular practice, you'll get the hang of it. Make sure you regularly exercise this aspect of grammar, and over time, it will become second nature to you. There you have it, language enthusiasts. A comprehensive introduction to modal verbs in reported speech. We hope this video has shed light on these unique and fascinating parts of English grammar. Remember, practice is key. So don't shy away from using these modal verbs in your daily conversations or writing exercises. Keep learning, keep practicing, and soon you'll master the art of reported speech with modal verbs. Until next time, Happy language learning!